So no matter what video I make, I just get to see one word in the comments. Editing, 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 editing. So in this video, let me answer all the questions that you asked me in the recent community post about editing. And in the end of this video, I'll show you how I shoot my cinematic b-rolls in live. So if you watch this video till end, you would be able to make an awesome b-roll like this. Let's go. So the first question, where did you learn editing from? So before six months, I was using a completely free software called Shortcut. I used basic YouTube tutorials to learn it. And I might have edited over 100 videos on Shortcut, which means I'm really good at it. But then time came when I had to upgrade. And that was the time when I switched to Premiere Pro. I was actually scared if I would be able to make the switch in the software. But this video, Learn Everything About Premiere Pro by Jack Cole helped me a lot. I mean, I already knew how to edit videos, like what effects to use, what sounds to use, and what text effects to use and all. All I needed to learn was a new editing software. Which brings me to the conclusion, learning how to edit a video is not same as learning a new editing software. What effects and transitions do you usually use in a video? I usually use light leaks or film bump transitions paired up with a camera shutter sound, which looks like this. And during the B-rolls, I usually use the speed ramps, which means I increase the speed of the ending of the first clip and the beginning of the second clip which move in the same direction. So that the final transition looks super smooth. And for text I usually go with the fonts which I like and then add a small drop shadow to it. And then finally add this small shaky effect paired up with the keyboard typing sound, which looks like this. And finally as a cherry on the top, I usually clone myself. I use masking for text and all and I use things like teleportation effects to take the video to the next level. What software do you recommend for beginners? See, I'm not the best person to answer this question, but Irfan Junejo in one of his videos says, starting with a good editing software like Premiere Pro and getting really good at it is much better than starting with a low-end software first and then iterating towards a better software. It obviously takes a lot of time in the beginning to learn, but it saves a hell lot of time in the later. And that's actually true. Yeah, answering these questions like this. Maza na yara. Let's go for a rapid fire round. software do you use? Adobe Premiere Pro. How long has it been since you started editing? One year on a free editing software called Shortcut and six months on Premiere Pro. How long does it take to edit one video? Um, not much but maybe around 15 hours. What are your PC specifications? So I use a normal student laptop which has Intel i5 8250U processor, 16GB RAM, 512GB SSD, 2TB HDD and which has 4GB Radeon graphic card. It's not the best in the market but it just gets the job done. Where did you learn editing? Did you take any course? I've learned everything on YouTube as I've already told. I take inspiration from popular creators like Peter McKinnon, Sam Colder, Gox Art, Casey Neistat, Kelly Vakasa and many more. But learning from YouTube is not so efficient. You obviously have a lot of information on YouTube but with a lot of information comes a lot of junk information. It took me a year to get to this level. And this is where Skillshare comes into picture. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of classes by industry experts on filmmaking, video editing, public speaking and many more. I've personally been using Skillshare for quite a lot of time now and I've previously taken this class how to shoot dope low budget films by Julian Klepper to learn how to shoot those cinematic shots at home. And I've recently taken this class DIY Cinematography by Ryan Booth where he explains how to make videos look like movie. And apart from this, if you'd like to learn video editing, I would recommend this class Advanced Video Editing with Premiere Pro 2020 by Jordi. I've taken it and it's great. And the best part about Skillshare is that it's completely ad-free and if you take the annual subscription, it costs around 2000 rupees a year, which roughly comes around 166 a month. And this is less than the cost of a biryani. And the first thousand of my viewers to join Skillshare using the custom link in the description gets one month free trail. So hurry up. And the last question for the video. How the hell do you create awesome b-rolls on your own? Guess I really have to show you. Let's go. So we are in my room right now. As you can see, this is not a studio. This is just my hostel room at IIT Kharagpur. So currently I'll show you how I shoot my cinematic b-rolls myself with my phone. So yeah, let's get started. So on this table, you can already see we have a cup. We have uh, a spoon over here. And along with this, we have some Amul Dood. 
सो एंड वी ऑल्सो हैव कॉफी इन माई रूम आई एम नॉट श्योर वेर इट इज जस्ट मिनट लेट मी जस्ट गेट इट ठीक है वी ऑल्सो गॉट द कॉफी सो to shoot any cinematic video the first step is to get a story the story can be very simple it can be like me making a coffee to drink that's it that's the story so once you get the story the next step is to get the shots like what shots you want shot by shots i mean clips video clips and then you shoot them like shooting is like more like a trial and error you need to play around with colors you need to play around with lights you need to play around with movements of the camera and all and after that it's all in the pro- post production so <clears throat> currently we have these four things this is all we got so what i'll do is i'll get the static shots of four and then i'll get the revealing shots of nescafe and milk and then we'll go into the main story where i open the amul doodh and then you know i just pour it into this cup and then i <clears throat> add some nescafe and then i stir it and i finally reveal it so this is it this is the main story which we have and now it's all about you know shooting it so let's go theek hai currently i'll be taking the you know static shots of all these four things like and whenever i shoot no i usually put uh, my phone into 60 fps and i'll uh, fix the auto focus and uh, you know the lighting and the auto focus both and now i'll get four single shots of this so let's go this is done so this is the second shot which i'm recording amul ka theek hai got it and now we have the th- third shot of uh, the milka cup so maybe we'll get a thoda sa niche exposure of this थ्री आर दन एंड नव यू ऑल्सो गॉट द स्पून इसका भी ले लेते हैं ठीक है सो नव यू गॉट द स्टैटिक शॉर्ट्स ऑफ ऑल द फोर थिंग्स नव विल रिवील मिल्क एंड विल ऑल्सो रिवील द नेस कैफे का दिस थिंग सो या एंड वील यूज दिस एज फोर राउंड वाइल रिवीलिंग द स्टफ सो लेट्स गो एंड वेन एवर आई यूजली रिवील स्टफ नो आई पुट द फोकस ऑन द बैकग्राउंड फर्स्ट एंड देन आई फिक्स इट एंड उसके बाद uh i hide it with things so when i reveal it that will be there on the focus all the time so and it's all about you know uh trial and error like you don't get the perfect shot in the first attempt itself you'll have to keep trying until you get you know satisfied with the shot so let's go theek hai i think that looks good so the next one And just like that, you have an awesome B-roll. And yeah, these are the most common questions that I got on the community post. I guess I answered them properly. And there were a hell lot of other questions which I did not include in this video. And if you'd like to see a second part of this video, do let me know in the comments. And also ask your questions. I'd be more than happy to answer them. And along with this, I'd be taking two free sessions on video editing at 7 p.m. on Saturday and Sunday on an academy. So if you'd like to learn video editing from me. The link is in the description. Use the code Tarun to access the live for free. Repeating it. Editing 7 p.m. Saturday and Sunday. An Academy. See you there. Bye bye. Yo, microphone check. Make it a microphone check. Give it a microphone. I make them make it a microphone dead. Don't step to me, newbie. I can truly be moody.